Hi class, Mrs. Arnold here. So we're going to begin today by looking at different aspects of the workspaces in Premiere Pro. First, we're gonna start with our project panel. Then we're gonna look at the media browser, the timeline, the source monitor. Then we're going to layer our clips. Then finally look at the program monitor. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, we're going to go ahead and begin with the project panel. Over here is my project panel. So it's gonna be on the lower left corner of the screen. Now, whenever I decide I want to take something from there and put it into my timeline, I'm just gonna click and hold and move it, just like so. I'm just gonna hold onto this and I'm gonna move it over here and put it there like so and it's in my timeline. Now I don't want it there, so I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of it. Over here we have our media browser. It's where we can go through and grab clips off of our computer, wherever we wanna go. I have a lot of my clips here. I'm just gonna scroll down all the way to video and just click some videos. Next, we're gonna go look at our timeline. Now the timeline is right here in the bottom part of our screen and this is the point where I can put clips together, I can move stuff here, I can scrub through, just kind of get an idea of where I want to place clips that I'm editing. You can also hit the space bar. The space bar is really good just to let things go, let things run, works great, feels great. Videos come in as thumbnails right here. You can see my click, my cursor. And then down here with our audio, audio comes in as waveforms. Our source monitor is here. It shows me the clip before I put it into the timeline. I can do a number of things at this point. I can set my in, I can set my out. Then I can just click, hold, and drag it into my timeline. We'll get into shortcuts later, but just know it kind of gives you a preview of the clip already in there. Now, we're gonna look at layering our clips. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring this back up. And now I can take this clip here and I can put it on top of that clip there. Take my scrub, move across, and as you can see, it's changing the scene. It's changing my clips like Photoshop, works just like, Premiere Pro works a lot like Photoshop within the layers. We work with the layers on the timeline. Now, finally, we have our program monitor. Now, the program monitor is the largest screen on the workspace here in Premiere Pro. It shows me everything that I have done, graphics, video, audio, throughout my entire timeline. If I want to put a title, I can put a title here, I can type it out, I can go hello. Okay, that's my graphic. I can place it here. You can hit the space bar and it'll play. Hello stays in the middle. Do I want to keep it there? No. But it shows me in the program monitor what I did. I hope that this has given you a brief insight into the workspaces of Premiere Pro. Now, we'll get in depth with the shortcuts and other graphics, video, and audio methods of Premiere Pro, but this is just a sample, a light taste, so that you can kind of sink your teeth into. So, thank you, good day.